Welcome to Mr. Sir Sports. We recently hit 1,000 subscribers, so thank all you guys for that. If you want to join the family and be entered to win a MacBook Pro and experience all the NFL news that's important that you need to know, hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you're notified when our videos go live. When we hit 10,000 subscribers, we're giving away a MacBook Pro, like I mentioned. So don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss a video. Thank you guys again, and enjoy the video. Everybody knows the Tampa Bay Buccaneers have a new head coach this year, former defensive coordinator for the team last year and for the previous years when they've had Tom Brady and company on the team, Todd Bowles. He's taken over as head coach, and he's a lot more aggressive when it comes to training camp than Bruce Arians was. Bruce Arians still put his team through everything they needed to learn in training camp, but Todd Bowles pushes the limits and pushes guys really far and tries to maximize their time out there. Well, he's maybe pushing them a little bit too far because Ryan Jensen, as everybody knows, their star center that retired and then came out of rec, got a retirement because Tom Brady came out of retirement to be the center again, all pro pro bowler. Ryan Jensen, as I said, got hurt, major knee injury, going to be out multiple months. Probably wouldn't have happened if Bruce Arians was the head coach because he is smart and doesn't push guys like Todd Bowles does. And just the other day as well, Tristan Wirfs, their star left tackle, hurt. Uh, just got cramps. Luckily, it wasn't anything major. He got carted off the field, so everyone thought it was much major of an injury. But what do you think about Todd Bowles pushing his guys, not really being very smart when it comes to, hey, these guys need time to recover and not pushing them past their limits? and being kind of old school and not adapting to new times. Yeah, it's tough to see. I mean, I think, uh, as you said, it's we're, we're in a new school mentality where you got to adjust to the times, especially you can't you, – you need to, uh, as the old saying goes, you need to know when to hold them, know when to fold them. And there's times where you need – as a coach, as a head coach especially, you need to know when to push the guys, but then you also need to know when to pull back a little bit and say, hey, like I'm not going to push you too hard and – you're going to let them get some rest, like you said, because the last thing you want to see is guys get hurt, especially guys who are going to be major components of that team, like Tristan Wirfs, who is still a very young player, I should say, um, drafted, I believe, in 2020, um, and then stepped right in and helped win the Super Bowl. And then Ryan Jensen, too. I mean, that's a huge part of your team. I think this, like the center position is very underrated in football, and you need someone really good back there. So Ryan Jensen being out is going to be a big loss. So yeah, I think he's pushing it too hard. I don't know. This is obviously a joke, but it's almost like he got wind of the fact that Leonard Fournette is out of shape or like allegedly out of shape. So he's like, oh, Lenny didn't put in the work this summer. Well, everyone else is going to like as a result. So who knows why why he's doing what he's doing, uh, Todd Bowles, that is. But I mean, sometimes you just can't really push guys too, too hard.